All right, back again, and today just wanted to show off my uh, Pikachu Nintendo 64 here. And uh, if you remember, I uh, picked this thing up the last time I went off to that uh, Super Hard Off, and I bought a lot of uh, different stuff. When I first saw this uh, sitting over there, there was one there that didn't have the uh, the same colored cover here for the expansion pack. And uh, it was just a regular cover, and I was like, ah, I don't think I'll pick it up. But then I found another one that actually had the cover on it, and I was like, well, I don't know, it looks kind of whack, but <laughs> I'll give it a shot, you know. So I picked it up, you know, brought it home, cleaned it up, didn't have any controllers or any cords or anything like that. So luckily I had this yellow one here, it's nothing too special, but uh, at least it matches the, the system. And uh, ripped it all down, scrubbed it up. Got it all looking sharp again, and uh, yeah, played a little bit of some games on it, and I thought to myself, it's not too bad, you know. It's a, it's a little bit strange as far as shape goes and, you know, concept, but it's not bad. Now, they had a, a couple of these things released with the kind of Pokemon theme to it. The first one was like the, uh, the blue and white and red one, and I think that one was just called the Pokemon uh, uh, Nintendo 64. This one's a Pikachu exclusive uh N64, and uh, it's got some kind of cool features to it. I mean, it's got the little Pokemon ball for the uh, the on-off switch. Uh, it might be kind of normal, but uh, one thing I thought was cool is uh, Pikachu's foot is the reset button, which, you know, that's kind of inventive. I was kind of looking at that, and I was like, damn, is there a reset on here? And then I was like, holy shit, it's his foot. That's kind of cool. And... Uh, the other thing I found was really cool is uh, when you power it on. So let's uh, give this a shot here. Figured we could put in some uh, Super Smash Brothers. I tried to look for any Pikachu game I could find uh, for this system, but uh, this is the only one I could find. There we go. Check out his cheeks. Is that not wild? Like, it blinks for, like, the first, I don't know, ten times or whatever, and then after that it just stays lit. I'd never seen anything like that before, and I was like, you know, that makes this machine kind of worth getting, because it's kind of wild, you know? But he stays all lit up like that, and then we can play our uh, Super Smash Brothers and stuff, so... as Pikachu with the uh, Pikachu N64, you know, oh yeah, but I figure we'll just give it a little bit of a, a go here, maybe just one round, I put up a video of this a while back, but uh, it was pretty low quality, I think, because of the fact that my uh, it was on my old CRT TV. But cheap shot but uh, yeah you know it it plays pretty good and there's no problems with it um, I wound up uh, taking on the inside here I don't know if you can see it or not uh, inside the flaps here I just uh, I cut out the uh, the two tabs here so I can put in my US games as well when I took it apart so it'll play all of them play the Japanese and the US ones and it's uh, yeah it's not too bad but, you know, I just thought I'd make a short little video here showing off good old Pikachu and the Pikachu N64. And uh, like always, I'll put up another video here soon. So, thanks for watching.